Tracking the size of a country's so-called underground or shadow economy is no easy task. The Korean government wants to target business activity that is unreported or underreported because it costs the nation a fortune in lost tax revenues. Oh Soo Young gives us an idea of how big the underground economy is here in Korea. The size of Korea's underground economy ballooned to an all-time high last year, reaching almost 380 billion U.S. dollars. According to a report by the Korea Development Institute, this accounts for roughly 30 percent of Korea's annual GDP and is more than 10 percentage points higher than the OECD average. The report attributes the vastness of Korea's underground economy to the rising demand for cash, fueled by low interest policies and growing economic uncertainties. Over the past four decades, the undocumented market in Korea has grown more than 560-fold. To crack down on unregulated business activities, the Korean government has been enforcing various measures. These include tax deduction benefits, requiring identification for financial transactions and issuing cash receipts. These initiatives seem to have worked to a degree. Experts say that without such measures, the scope of Korea's underground market would have reached some $490 billion last year, or roughly 40 percent of the country's GDP. To bring the shadow economy into the light, experts say more efforts should be taken to formalize unregulated activities, such as strengthening cash receipt requirements and issuing electronic transaction bills. Oh Soo-young, Arirang News.